Hello everyone. In this video, we'll show what all USB accessories we can connect to iPad using this Lightning 2 USB 3 camera adapter. Uh, we can connect many USB devices to iPad or iPhone using this adapter. Uh, watch the full video to know how each of these accessories work with iPad. I'm using iPad Air 3 with 64 GB and 64 GB is not enough for regular workflow. So to free up the memory space in iPad, uh, we need an external memory device like pen drive, hard disk or SSD. This adapter is very useful to transfer files between iPad and uh, other USB devices and to connect other types of uh, USB accessory. Uh, watch the full video till the end so you will come to know uh, what all devices we can connect and how we can use them. One by one I will start connecting these uh, USB devices and I uh, will show how these all accessories work. First we will connect the wireless USB mouse. This wireless uh, mouse works without connecting the power adapter, I mean the iPad charger. We can see here the mouse is working fine. Here I am playing a video of all intros of few of my video tutorials. These graphics and video editings are created in iPad Air 3. Regularly I upload uh, motion graphics tutorials and uh, video editing tips and tricks using LumaFusion and one more app, uh, graphics app that is Vectornator uh, and uh, it is free to download and it is very helpful for uh, creating illustrations and uh, vector images. And uh, I have created playlists and uh, video tutorials of motion graphics. You can check out my channel for more information. Those who are new to my channel and uh, watching this video, they can tap above provided information link and uh, browse through my channel. Now I will connect and check the wired USB mouse. As we can see here the wired USB mouse is also working fine. Next we will connect the wired USB keyboard. For keyboard also we no need to connect the power adapter of the iPad. Without the power adapter uh, the USB mouse and uh, USB wired keyboard works fine. Not sure why this uh, on-screen keyboard is appearing when we have connected this uh, USB uh, keyboard. Uh, this is first time I'm connecting these accessories to my iPad. Next I will connect uh, 32 GB SanDisk USB 2.0 pen drive. To browse the content of the pen drive, we need to open the files app and when we connect the pen drive, it will uh, appear at the left side of the iPad and uh, we can select the pen drive and we can browse through the contents. Here we can see a pop-up message uh, saying that uh, we cannot use accessories cruiser force the accessory requires much power so so we need external power to be supplied to the pen drive so we can connect a uh, iPad charger power adapter or uh, uh, I am using here MI 10,000 mAh power bank 
using this uh, i will connect it to the lightning port of the adapter and uh, then we can access the pen drive the pen drive will appear at the left side here now we can see the pen drive is connected again once again i will uh, remove it and reconnect Pendrive has a video and we can play the video directly in iPad. Next I will connect 1TB uh, Seagate hard disk. The hard disk is covered with some plastic cover so we cannot see it. This hard disk will not work when we directly connect it to iPad because the iPad is not capable of supplying the current or power required to run the hard disk. So I will try connecting the MI power bank to provide the current power to hard disk from the power bank. We can see a blue light appearing on the hard disk but it's turning off immediately. Even the power bank is not capable of uh, supplying that much power to run the hard disk. So to connect the hard disk to iPad, we need powered USB hub. Next I will connect uh, Sennheiser headphone with mic. To check this I need to open voice memos whether the mic is working or not. I will start recording and I will tap on the mic. Here we can see the mic is working. And now I will put the mic on mute. Now we can see the mic is off. I will turn it on and I will tap on the mic again. Again the mic is working. So this device also works with the adapter without the uh, external power supply. Next I will connect the iPhone. This is iPhone SE with iOS 12. When we connect the iPhone, uh, it will appear in the Photos app. Uh, only here we can import the photos from the iPhone to iPad. This is how all these different types of USB accessories work with this uh, connecting adapter. At the end of this video I am sharing the summary. You can check the chart and you will get the all the information you required. You can ask doubts and questions regarding this uh, USB 3 camera adapter in the comment section. Also you can check out my uh, latest uh, LumaFusion uh, motion graphics tutorials from the above link uh, thank you for watching and uh, subscribe to my channel